Uh, we still uh, are only guessing, but the fact that they were arrested for uh, 20 days is further complicating the story and attracting a lot of attention to what's going on between the two countries. And I think uh, the Turks will uh, jump on this opportunity uh, to uh, explain uh, in a very strange way that they feel uh, very frustrated about the relations with Israel. They signaled very often in the last few months that they want to improve the relations. Israel uh, did not really react to it. So I think uh, the fact that the, the relations are so much in the headline now is helping them to make a point. What do you make of the uh, what we see is the apparent attempt among uh, Turks there to frame this as a completely normal response to this type of activity, comparing it to photographing the Pentagon or the prime minister's residence in Israel? Is, is that so far the, the leading narrative around why this couple is being detained? Yeah, first of all, the palace of Erdogan, as uh, everybody knows, is in Ankara and not in Istanbul. And uh, what they took photos of is not the traditional palace of uh, heads of state in Turkey, the Dolma Bahce, but a home, a villa uh, uh, from which Erdogan is operating while he is in Istanbul. And uh, this place uh, is guarded and uh, there are instructions not to take photos. Most of the tourists do not know even that this is the place where Erdogan stays and uh, definitely do not know that uh, they should not uh, take big photos, but when it comes to the court, and it's a breach of a, a, a Turkish uh, legislation, the court. And, uh, and who knows who jumps on this opportunity to, uh, to attract it to really a diplomatic crisis. Now, along those lines, what is it thought that uh, President Erdogan is looking to leverage uh, by detaining these tourists here? What's the situation might we see some movement on? Well, first of all, obviously, tourism is very important to Turkey, and Israelis continued to, to fly to Turkey, especially from the Arab society. Figures are very high. Uh, but there are more important issues for Erdogan to attract attention to, especially the situation in Libya. And uh, Turkey is highly invested in Libya. Both in Libya is um, uh, spending a lot of money in Libya. And Israel recently entered this uh, issue and uh, is, is starting to operate uh, inside Libya, hosted the uh, Libyan delegate here, and I think the most urgent uh, issue for Erdogan is to try and create a dialogue between Israel and Turkey on the Libyan issue. And uh, this is how I read his mind. I have no uh, uh, signals that uh, in any way they are yet tying the issue, but I think this is a very urgent matter for Erdogan. Certainly, we'll stay tuned on this issue. Appreciate your insight on what is still a developing and apparently diplomatic, growing diplomatic issue here. Ambassador Alon Liel, former Israeli ambassador to Turkey. Thank you very much.